other activity happening this weekend, Kentuckiana Pride Festival. Yeah, thousands of people are going to be in Louisville celebrating, expressing who they are. Jim Stratman is live this morning at the Big Four Lawn to show us what we can look for tomorrow. Jim, good morning. Well, good morning, Eric. We've been talking all morning long about the Kentucky and a Pride Festival, which is going to be down here at the Big Four Lawn. Of course, all the vendors are already set up, have already set up their tents. They're getting ready for, uh, for Saturday's big event. But another thing happening on Saturday, actually something that will lead you right to Kentucky and a Pride Festival is the Kentucky and a Pride Parade. And with me right now is Stephen Armstrong, the chair of the parade. Stephen, the parade happening again on Saturday, it's always a huge event, big time. How excited are you to kick this one off again? We're really, really excited about the parade this year. We have um, over 100 groups participating. We're anticipating about eight to 9,000 participants walking in the parade. Um, going to be one of our biggest parades um, in the history of the foundation, so we're super, super excited about this. And that's so cool because the parade is always really big as itself, but to see it grow and continue to grow over the years, and especially this year, that's got to say a lot about just kind of uh, the number of people who want to be involved. Yes, um, we, the parade year over year has grown um, and we have organizations th throughout the community. They're going to be involved from local businesses um, to major corporations such as UPS, um, Humana. Some of our big sponsors are going to be there. So we're really excited about this. It's lo we love to see uh, the uh, festival and the parade grow every year. Really quickly, details people need to know about when the parade starts, where it starts, and some of the passes they can just go ahead and set up on. Um, so the parade's going to start um, in the Nulu area where you start there at uh, Market Street and Campbell in front of Feast. Mm -hmm. um, it pr proceeds down uh, Market Street, making a right onto Preston in front of uh, the stadium, and then we'll go all the way down here to the festival grounds here at the waterfront. So um, one of the biggest things is the, the streets will be closed, obviously, so parking is challenging. Mm -hmm. So we're encouraging people um, who are going to be at the parade to get there early, um, find parking. It will be around the street, or um, we are going to have parking here at the festival grounds if you yes. plan on coming down um, you can park here and walk up so that's the biggest thing um, is parking um, and the parade does start at noon um, and we hope the uh, to be done with about 1 30 to 2 o'clock um, and um, the street will be closed most of the day so uh, getting in and out will be challenging so just be patient with that um, and get there early so you can get plenty of parking and um, enjoy the time sounds good thank you so much Steve and Eric